I'm a foreign language teacher. I love it. Especially now you realize how important communication is. Outside of China, there was sort of an expectation that it would bloom as we're seeing in other countries and our numbers are still low, but I'm from New York, the epicenter of the crisis. There's only 8,000 people here as opposed to New York, which had, I think, about 13 million. We just found out that there are four people in town that have contracted COVID-19. It's not that thing that's on distant shores. It's actually here. There is some residual feeling of guilt as well. Within the next two to three weeks, the States is preparing for up to 100,000 deaths. Here, I'm riding around town and looking at the beautiful cherry blossoms. There are days when I chat with friends and the conversation's almost devoid of happiness. As I'm talking to you, I, uh, my chest gets tight. And I was talking with another friend and he was saying, I came to New York with a dream and I don't even know if that dream will be possible after this.